Right, this is just a, <clears throat> a quickie about the Pulsar. If you're wondering how, we, how we're getting on uh, with the Pulsar, um, it's been great really. Um, Size-wise, we've managed to get into every big city and small village. So we've been able to go on a car park, uh, we've parked up every... In any spot we've managed to get. Little country roads. Little country roads we've been down. I mean, single track roads that you can't get a big motor home down. It's been good. Um, the only downside that we found, uh, and, and you've got to compromise on something, but we have yeah. cushions to make the bed up, and we have to put it in the. Uh, we have to put them in the bathroom, and it's just that <coughs> if we stop and want to use the loo, we have to take them all out. That, that's a bit of a pain, yeah, really. Yeah, it's a isn't bit of it? a pain, but anyway. But that's the only pain. To be honest yeah. with you, the, the shower has been good because we've got the trigger shower. Yeah, that, and it's great. And I've been like washing my hair and conditioning it. And yeah. we've you don't use great. a lot of water, do you? No, you don't. Because you, you swill so yourself down, then you, you lard yourself up, and then you swill yourself off. Yeah. And you've hardly used any water. So uh, we, we've both had a shower with one. Uh, hot water, haven't we? When we turn the hot water on, we both get a shower out of that, no yeah, problem. And yeah. you do your air as well. Yeah, I do. The kitchen, yeah. the table at the back where we make the kitchen into an L shape, has been a godsend. Without that, brilliant. Uh, I mean, that's give you the you extra can, space. You can use it as a prep um, yeah. table, or you can use it when you're washing up. You can put all your your um, wet pots on there, and yeah. we have like a little draining. Um, like a, what would you call it? like a mat like a draining mat, mat yeah, yeah. A draining <coughs> mat that you that you put them on and that so don't get wet through everywhere no. i think the mm -hmm. other thing that's uh, been really good has been the swivel table that's miles better because you just move it out of the way so um anyway yeah. i can hear kettle brewing so we're gonna <laughs> yeah. Cup of go tea and get now. that on right just so you know um we're using two books one is the uh, France Passion, and the other one is the All the Airs in France. We've got a North and a South. Now, these are old. These are only the second edition, and they're up to the fourth edition now. We need to update them, don't we? Yeah, we do. So, um, do you want to show yeah. us um, how the airs work? Um, right, okay. Just to give people so, a guide. Yeah, so you've, uh, you've got your map here, and you've got all your different colours. So, like, we're coming down here at the moment. So, if we want to find an air... We obviously we go to the to the blue colour and each one has a number. So you would find that which is we're in Brittany, which again as you can see is your is your blue colour. And you find that number and here's where your number is there. So and that tells you your sight. So yeah. that's what we're doing. We keep putting them up on screen. So you can see, see uh, yeah, which you know, ones, briefly which, which ones, ones we've gone to, and that. So it, it, so each part of France has all different yeah. colours, and it tells you up here in the key. It tells you how much, so, whether it's got water, whether it's got what facility. Yeah, it's there's got. all these little. You see the little symbols yeah. here. Yeah. So, for example, that means it's free. Um, it, it doesn't have water. Doesn't have uh, emptying facilities on this one. So some of them are a lot better than others. So yeah, it's just yeah. a matter of flicking through. Yeah. through and them. It's, a, the, it's a little bit out of date. Obviously, it's a second edition. Yeah, so it might yeah. say uh, five euros. But when you get there, it's seven or eight euros yeah, or ten euros. It says ten euros and, and it become yeah. 12, maybe 13 euros. Yeah. So that's that's what we use. Um, and they're great for when you're going into the town because... Yeah. Virtually every town has an air, so yeah. uh, if you want to be yeah. in the middle of it all and just pay a couple yeah. of quid, um, and you get um, you get a more detailed 
a map, a bigger, a bigger one, map, a yeah. bigger map with comes yeah, with yeah, it yeah, as yeah, well. Yeah. So that's it's really good. Now the France Passion, uh, this is the one that we said that we've just joined. Um, yeah, you this buy is the good. book every yeah. year, March, yeah. and it and it and it's March to March. Yeah, uh, so it's about thirty. 30 euros so that tells you all about it and then this is the parts mm. um which which gives you like a closer up view yeah. uh, of where of where you're going uh, and what happens is is you um you find a color where you are tells you here so if you're in this area you would go to the pink so you find pink it tells you what page number 244 so you would go to 244 which is pink there and it tells you then all the names of the heirs here which and, you can and go what to. they are they're farms and they're either vineyards or um uh, the chap that we've we've come to today it, yeah. it's a, a cow farm it's yeah. a, it's a beef farm so yeah we bought some uh sausage, some and, burgers. sausage and burgers from him but yeah. you're not you don't have to buy anything but yeah uh it, it, he's got a little shop there yeah. we just fancied uh, a couple of bits uh, and yeah. that's what we've done so uh, and, it, and and again this symbols it tells you at what time you can arrive up until so on this one it's at 8 30 yeah um he, the, the, he has water but they do say only ask for it if you're absolutely desperate they've got waste and it tells you here that he, he they actually speak languages so yeah. in this yeah. case he speaks english gb and yeah. what was the tree what did that mean now um the shade yeah there's some shaded areas if you need shade yeah so yeah so that's how that works basically so what do you think of the french pa passions up to now this well, is yeah. the second night they're quiet they're just a little bit rural so yeah if you want a quiet free night in the uh, sticks a bit it, aren't they it, yeah they're just a bit out out of the town yeah. uh and it's a nice quiet night and you can yeah. actually camp outside you can use your deck chairs and do yeah. cooking outside whereas the airs you're not supposed to do that they frown upon it yeah uh you've got to do everything inside yeah. but you get a map you get a bigger map and then like i said at the beginning if you want to look at it closer up Mm. there's your parts of the map you do get an app with this so, and i find that very very useful yeah. I, I prefer the app to the book to be honest with you yeah uh, you but, do, but, you? but k plays yeah. about with the book yeah uh, well i do while we're traveling don't that gives me something to do in that yeah. uh, because we're here we're here at the, we're going there tomorrow aren't we yeah so is it crows on yeah, yeah that's it yeah yeah, yeah, yeah yeah so um it doesn't obviously give you all the details of all the other the little places but the main places in big letters yeah um yeah but anyway that's that's the edge that's how on. those work anyway so you'll you'll see these pop up in our videos just yeah. so you know what they are yeah right this is a map in part one where we traveled from calais to dieppe and then from dieppe we went to fee camp then to Le Havre, and then to Honfleur. Right, this is our view for tonight. We're going to park up here and... Um, well, we have parked up. Well, we have parked up, yeah. Uh, and we're going to go into town. So we'll let you know what, what this place is like. What's it called, love? Honfleur. Honfleur in the northern part of France. In fact, it's in Normandy.
uh, we've got a map here and it's showing you from Honfleur, then to Deauville, and then we went to Austrasum, and then we went on to Brickebec, uh, or Brick Quebec, um, which took us a full day travelling because it was raining. Well, we're just going to go for a walk. Um, we found this air. Um, I don't know if you can see it. There's only five bands, I think, that, that's on here. Um, and we're just tucked away here in our little. I don't know if you can see it. Our little bit of uh, grassy area. Yeah. yeah. There is. Fishing lake at um, the bottom there. We're now in Britain and we're on the west coast. So we're going to start making our way down, hopefully. Yeah, it's after been today. Yeah, it's not been a very nice day today. It's been raining. It's been, been all, raining all most of the day, so we've yeah. done the travelling. So yeah. um, we're just we're having a walk into town. We've had a lovely curry, haven't we? Yeah, just had a nice uh, curry. It was a quick curry, and all. It wasn't something that took ages. It was and we just threw in loads of leftovers, didn't we? A bits and bobs <laughs> that we had, threw it all yeah. in with a bit of chicken. <laughs> yeah, that's what that you usually nice. do, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Throw all the rubbish in. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so. I'll just show you this. This is a this is a fishing lake that we're on the side of. So we're going to walk past down here into the town. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, it's, it is a lovely. It is a lovely yeah. You can see. And um, this has not cost anything. I think it's free. Yeah, it's got a toilet. <laughs> There's no it's machine or anything. Yeah. Now, whether you have to pay for water, because I, I noticed that it's one of them automated machines, so maybe you have to pay for water. I don't know. Yeah, but we, we filled up, didn't we, today? We filled up, we're all right. Yeah. Uh, we had a shower this morning in the van. <coughs> and then we, we refuelled. Yeah. So, yeah, we're all right. So, we'll have a walk down into town, <coughs> and we'll come back to you later. God, right, we've just got half, what's this called now? I forget what it was called. Vandalies. Yeah, love it. And we'll, put it, we'll put it on anyway, um, on the map, the uh, so you can see it. Can and it's halfway it. to St. Marlow from where we was, uh, coming from the coast. Um, yeah. So we're having a look round, it's a lovely shopping place, so we're gonna have a look round, um, and we'll let you know what we think of it. Yeah, it's like more like a city centre thing. It is, yeah, it's, it's quite a big area, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's a big place, but uh, it's just a stop off for us to stretch our legs and have a quick walk round. Yeah, and she'll be buying out. some, like she normally oh, does. Oh, God, yeah, that's all I want to sell about. Get your wallet out, Jim. I haven't got a wallet anymore. <laughs> anyway, I'll show you. You can see that uh, it's a centre shop. We're at St. Marlowe. 
going, we're just having a walk around. This is the beach. I'm going to have a look for uh, a restaurant or something, for something to eat. So, and then, yeah, seven o'clock at night. And uh, you can see where we are. This, uh, this is the beach at St. Marlow anyway. Restaurants are uh, and the cobble streets. So this is um, this is lovely. This, isn't it? We're gonna have to call in one of these babes. You you always cost you always cost me an arm and a leg. What's it? Not oysters, lobsters. The lobsters, about 150 quid, I think. 150 quid for flaming lunch. We didn't even have a pudding. <laughs> right, well, we found a restaurant, haven't we? Yeah, we're going to have some uh, oysters. We're having some oysters. Yeah. And we're having fish and chips. Fish and chips, yeah. I don't think it'll be Especially like... Caught. I don't think it'll be like the English one, though. No, no. And then we're having a sweet and a bottle of wine. It was having sweet. Oh, I we're thought doing, we was. We're doing the two-course one. For oh, the oh, three. Right. oh, Yeah. Right. Yeah. You've been too full. You've all right then, all right then. Yeah. 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 Show them a picture of the place. Okay then. <laughs> As we're walking around the town, we've just found this little camping area. It's 13 euros, 12, 12 something euros. And we're right next to this estuary where the, uh, the water comes in and there's, there's boats on the other side. Um, this is in the same town as where we just had the crepes, but we just thought we'd have a look around and follow the side. Hey? Oh yeah, look, they've all got electrical cups. Nice one, isn't it? So, yeah. It's, uh, it's lovely. Yeah. There's a few on, not, not that many, but there's a few on. Right. We're just heading to, to Crozon, aren't we? Yeah. And we just yeah. called um, off at this little town. Yeah, we're going to um, a France Passion site tonight. We are, yeah. We've got about half an hour to go. Yeah. Uh, we've just got to relax and... We've just and called off in this lovely little pretty town, Yeah, we, we? We, we've called off, I'll show you. You can't really see it from here, really. It's a, it's a, a quiet town. Uh, that's the fishery. They, they sell fish and... Yeah and stuff like that and we, we stopped off at this cafe we're having a, a crepe each with ice cream well yeah. we think we've ordered a crepe each <laughs> with, with ice cream, cream. <laughs> and, and a coffee with milk yeah now the last cappuccino we had was like an es espresso <laughs> with, with a big blob of an frothle. espresso with, with a, a blob of, a blob of froth, 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 froth on top, top. on it it looked look like a dessert yeah it's like <laughs> a strong uh, yeah. it's quite um, it's been quite cold today 
Friday, but the sun's yeah. just started to come out at this time, believe it or not. But it's still chilly, and that's why we've got fleeces on today. Yeah, which yeah. Is a, which is a shame. That's obviously hence why there's no not many people sat out in the little cafes. But, it's dead everywhere, though, isn't it? Wherever we go. In these little towns, it is. There's yeah. no one. There's the no fishing, one. the fishing villages have got people in, haven't oh, they? Oh, uh, the now? seaside places. Yeah, the seaside places. Yeah, but yeah. these little towns. It, it's so dead. Quiet. It's like. Where is everyone? Yeah. And when when you're walking, you can hear a pin drop. It's like deserted, it's like deserted, aren't they? It's like the Wild West, you know, the dirty dozen. You don't hear anything and when someone comes in. Yeah, everyone looks. You can hear them from miles, yeah. Yeah, Yeah, and everyone looks at us. They must say, God, English, when we come in. Mind you, look a bit like French. You look a bit French. No, I do not. You do, honestly. You do with your nose. Honestly, you look French. You don't know what it is. Yeah, it's either your ears, your eyes, or... <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you. Anyway.